Yep, exactly, exactly. So what we're going to do is a little, <laughs> a little game is just try and randomly talk about what's on the slide for around 30 seconds, basically. Okay, so here we have an elderly gentleman walking down a street in what looks like China. The street's extremely busy. There's bicycles either side and lots of red, bright, colourful flags flying down the down the street. Let's go. So Issa, you have got the next one starting here. So this is an Amazon Echo Dot. It's a tool used to it's like a virtual assistant, but in real life, you can ask tool to tell you about the weather. <laughs> in the image, we have a guy in a boat in a frosty area. So I presume that's somewhere in England because that looks where I grew up. Well, come on. <laughs> so <laughs> here we have... Good luck with this one. <laughs> here we have some bubbles. Maybe it's like... <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have some red bubbles on the right, blue bubbles on the left. Uh, it could be the bottom of a glass of sorts. Pretty abstract. Here we have an Amazon Prime box, cardboard box, uh, which is around, I'd say around 50 centimeters by 30 centimeters by 50 centimeters, I'd say. And inside there could be a range of things from perhaps a microphone to maybe a PlayStation, for example. This is a um, phone, and we can see all different apps this person has. Uh, this is a representation of our society nowadays, so we can see uh, social media tools such as Snapchat. Here we have Stonehenge, one of the, I suppose, most popular monuments in the world. It was kind of unknown why it was built or how it was built, but often said that it was for sort of religious rituals or... And the house is, <laughs> looks looks somewhat affordable. It's got a, a slanted <laughs> roof to keep, the, to keep the rain off and white walls around it with no windows though. So if you lived in that house, you wouldn't be able to see <laughs> too much of what's, what's going on outside it. My first car, um... It was just this terrible little Peugeot that wasn't anything suited like this car was um, for off-roading. And unfortunately, I grew up in an area with lots of fields and things like that. And we always had to go over them if there was a road closed. So we are giving now Bernard feedback. And let's begin. So I've submitted my feedback. Once everyone has submitted their feedback, we'll see it on the wall on the right-hand side. So the lowest one there is, was the message clear? <laughs> Which for impromptu <laughs> topics is probably to be expected. 